Hey folks, uh, AJ here from HotTubParts.net. Want to make a quick video on the Jumbo Jet. If you have this jet in your hot tub, there is no mistaking it with anything else on the market. This is the Jumbo Jet. We have it in stock here at HotTubParts.net. Uh, big failure on the Jumbo Jet is that internal nozzle. It's uh, running on a, on a retainer clip and a bearing system. That's going to wear out eventually and pop out. You lose the ability to have that nice uh, pulsating massage that spins on that jet. So when changing the Jumbo Jet internal, you're going to give it a hard turn and just thread it all the way out, okay? Out of its body, comes pops right back out. Now, there's a double thread on the back of the Jumbo Jet internal. So when you go to thread it back in, and you're going to put it right back into the housing, if you go all the way, it's going to turn the water off to the Jumbo Jet. No water flow is going to come back out of it. So you're going to have to come back just that quarter turn until you feel it stop. And then it's in the on position. Water flow will continue to come out of that jumbo jet for you. You'll be back in business. As far as the housings goes, if your housing uh, has to has cracked and needs to be changed from a leakage or whatnot, the one thing you need to know is silicone, silicone, silicone. This is uh, a big jet with a big lock nut. It requires a lot of silicone, both on the back shoulder of the jet and on the back housing. When you go to put it back on, uh, you're going to go through at least a tube, if not more, of silicone when you put this guy back in. This one has a 3 8 barb airline and a 3 quarter inch waterline right here. We have all the jumbo jet parts on the website. Uh, they're also on the link below this video in the description box. Any questions beyond this video on the jumbo jet or any other part you may have for your hot tub, feel free to give us a call. We are hottubparts.net, your hot tub parts authority.